Hey, what's up you guys? My name is Tyler Ruggy. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today we're switching it up. We're doing it a little bit different on my channel. I usually do reptiles, sometimes birds. Once in a while I show my rabbits, but never have I ever put out hamster content. And that's because for the majority of my life here on YouTube, I haven't had a hamster. I had a hamster about four years ago and I think if you've seen my first Meet My Pets video, I had a hamster. And for my first hamster ever, I made a lot of mistakes. As time went on, I kind of fixed a lot of those mistakes and improved my hamster care. But poor little Sonic eventually passed away. Sonic was my Robodorf hamster. And I, for a while now, have been kind of thinking about getting another hamster. I've been wanting one. So I decided I was gonna go ahead and prepare myself to get a hamster because I want to be prepared and I want a hamster and I want to do it in the least impulsive way possible. So I bought a bunch of stuff for my hamster and I'm going to be doing a haul today. Let me know if you enjoy this fantastic hamster content even though there isn't actually a hamster in it. And let's get straight into this. So first off, we have this box of stuff. There's just a ton of stuff in here <laughs> that I got from Pickles Pet Shop. So Pickles, AKA Tara, is a friend of mine who also does, you know, pet tube videos. Her channel is Pickles Pets and she runs an online pet shop and she was nice enough to send me some supplies to prepare me for my future hamster. So if any of you guys want to check out Pickles Pet Shop, she actually just reopened the shop the day that this video goes up. From now until June 8th, you can use code TYLER10 to get 10% off your purchase on Pickles Pet Shop. And that will be linked down in the description below. She sells stuff for small animals as well as reptiles. And also if you place an order June 1st or 2nd, you will get a free classic Pickles12807 wristband. So I just thought I would throw that in there. Go to Pickles Pet Shop, use my code, get 10% off. It's a fantastic deal. I don't know why you wouldn't take advantage of that. So yeah, anyways, I'm trying to keep my intros under like 10 minutes at this point because everyone tells me my intros are too long. So let's just get straight into this haul. First of all, we have this thing. It's a cardboard cheese and like do I need to explain why I was so excited to get this? It not only serves as like a fun little thing for your hamster guy to like crawl on top of and explore inside of but it's also cardboard so he gets to chew it. So it's honestly like it's a hide, it's a staircase, it's a piece of cheese, it's cardboard, it's everything your hamster needs all in one. So that was really cool. Thank you Pickle for sending me that. And then we also have a similar concept, but a rocket ship. And then we have another similar concept, but a spaceship or a UFO. It says Pip's Mothership on it. So it's actually Pip's Mothership. I was so stoked to get these. And I'm also gonna say I got a lot of stuff for my hamster. So it's probably not all gonna go in his or her cage at the same time because I don't know if it's all gonna fit in there. But yeah, I got just, you know, a normal wooden hide. This is by KT and it's just, you know, plain wood. And what I like about it is it's natural. The hamster can chew on it because your hamster obviously needs a bunch of stuff to chew on. So it's gonna be good for wearing down teeth. And it's also a hide. So it's like all in one. What I'm trying to do is make this cage kind of as naturalistic as possible. So I'm avoiding putting plastic in there probably other than the wheel, just cause I want everything to be natural and I just wanna have like a cool natural vibe to it. So yeah, this is by KT as well. It's like a terracotta hide, I think it's called, but really it's like not an effective hide. It's like a tube. You get it, you get it. It's just a tube or a hide, subscribe to my YouTube channel. So I got this veg tea bowl. I hate you, Katie, with your stupid puns. Just kidding, I, I live for it, honestly. Yeah, this is really hecking cute. However, 
This is like bigger than I imagined it was going to be. Like obviously this is a bit large for a food dish for a hamster. So I was thinking maybe I could use it as like a sand bath or like maybe I'll just use it for my rabbits. I don't really know. It's a big hamster food bowl. I could technically do it. It would just be ridiculous. But it was really cute nonetheless. So we have this little wooden toy. This is the KT Knot Nibbler, the mini size, because it comes in multiple sizes. It's just a cute little toy. Again, for the hamster to chew on. And then we got the KT Combo Chews. They look like little apples, so cute. And again, these are just like pieces of wood for the hamster to chew on. Do you see a theme going on here? We also have Ecotrition cheese flavored chews for the hamster. Little pieces of fake cheese, we love that. And then I also have just like some little hamster treats. You wanna give your hamster treats in moderation, but you still wanna give your hamster a treat once in a while because they will love you forever. These are Hazel Hamster Lovelies with banana, strawberry, and apricot. That's all of the stuff I got from Pickles Pet Shop. Once again, a huge thanks to Tara for sending those to me. Use code TYLER10, it's linked down below, and get a discount on some pet supplies. You're welcome. So next stop is PetSmart. I actually only got one thing from PetSmart, and that was the hamster food. So I got the Higgins Sunburst Gourmet Blend. This is for hamsters and gerbils. Um, there's a lot of really crappy hamster foods on the market that are filled with like colorful bits and crap. That's obviously not super good for your hamster. So this is actually a really good blend of food. There isn't like a bunch of those stupid colorful like pellets in there. This was recommended to me by a lot of people who have hamsters, so I trust my hamster friends. And that's the only thing I got from PetSmart. I price matched this and I think it was only like $6. Thank you PetSmart for price matching everything that I buy from you. And then the next stop was Petco. So at Petco, I got Missouri Rat and Mouse Diet. So these are pellets, if you couldn't tell from the name, they're for mice and rats. So you might be like, Tyler, why the heck are you giving this to your hamster? This is to add a little bit of extra protein in your hamster's diet because a lot of the hamster foods actually don't have as high of a protein content as it should. So a lot of people give these to their hamster just to give them some extra protein. And the only other thing that I got from, oh, also, also I wanted to say that this at Petco is like $13 or something, but you can price match Petco's in-store prices with their online prices. And on the Petco website, this was only like six or $7. So I saved like almost 50% by price matching, which was incredible. So always price match, I'm just saying, so you guys can save as much money as possible. And then I got a bendy bridge, so it's literally just these pieces of wood connected together and it bends to create a bridge or other shapes that are fun and exciting. And I think this was like $4. So last but not least, I went to Home Goods. Home Goods is like a hit or miss usually, but you can sometimes find really, really cute pet supplies there that are actually really affordable. So I went there because I wanted to find a cute little food dish for my hamster. And I bought something that once again is a little big, but here it is. It's like this really cool like white and gray marble look. And it was only $2.99. So this is like such a cute little bowl. And yeah, it's like a little big for a hamster, but I'm gonna use it. It's really freaking cool. And then the last two things that I got is not for my hamsters, but I'm gonna show you anyways, cause I'm super excited for them. I got these food and water dishes for my rabbits and they have donuts on them. Need I say anything else? Like, look how cute these are. And again, these were $3.99 each. So much cheaper than bowls at the pet store and also so much cuter. And I'm so excited to give these to Desmond and Olive. I know it's a hamster haul and I'm sorry that I plagued you with rabbits in this video, 
but I just needed to show that to you. So yeah, that concludes my hamster haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'm so excited to get a hamster and just spoil them with like all of the things that I got and I'm going to get more stuff. If you guys have any suggestions of like supplies that you guys like to get for your hamster or different like hacks as far as things you can get from not the pet store because I love going to other places and getting things for cheaper and being creative. If you have any suggestions for how I can just spoil the heck out of my hamster, let me know and I will happily take some of your suggestions. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys liked it, give it a big thumbs up. If you hated it, please still give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new here and if you want to meet my future hamster when they get here, then please just subscribe and you won't miss it. Also make sure to hit the notification bell to get notified every time I upload. Check out my social media links and my vlog channel. Those will be linked down in the description below. And I will see you guys in my next video.